Well, millions of us receive gift cards for the holidays, but research shows nearly $1 billion worth of them goes unused every year. Yeah, some of that money is stuck on the cars that are usually partially used. So 7 on your side's Michael Finney joining us with a tip on how to get more out of those cars. Let me tell you how long I've been working on this. Okay. They were oh. gift certificates. Really? We wow. work on our first oh, okay. laws in this state. Right. Yeah, this state has got some fabulous laws around gift cards, gift certificates. So how often does this happen to you? You use a gift card, but it still has a couple of bucks left on it. Now, we can only guess most consumers throw it in a drawer, forget about it, lose it, toss it out. But I don't want you to do that because by law, you can redeem those cards for cash. Spencer Seidler shows us pictures of the little Christmas village his girlfriend Marina made by hand. She's kind of crafty and likes to do little projects. They bought everything they needed at Michael's Arts and Crafts in San Rafael. The paint and like little trees. I hadn't ever done a little craft project like this. So. Marina is at work talking to us via FaceTime. She says she learned a lot about glitter, glue, and also about consumer rights. When we were checking out, her card was, I think, $30. The couple used a $30 Michael's gift card to buy the materials. After they paid, the card still had $1.53 left on it. So I asked the lady, I'm like, hey, can we just get that $1.53 back as cash? She's like, no, we don't do that. Spencer told the clerk that state law requires retailers to give cash back on store gift cards worth less than $10. That's to make sure consumers don't lose that leftover money. Couldn't she check with her manager? She just looks at me and goes, I've asked my manager for cash back on gift cards before, and she always says no. Spencer Marina left the store. It was just a small amount after all, but it bothered Spencer. It's the, it's the principle. You know, suppose there's 10,000 people that got gift cards and everybody leaves a dollar or two on there. He contacted Seven on your side. We asked Michaels why it didn't refund that money. Right away, a manager called Spencer to apologize, telling us we are aware of the gift card law in California and have trained new hires and existing employees. Unfortunately, this incident was contrary to our company's policy and inconsistent with our statewide training. We are conducting an internal investigation to determine why Mr. Seidler was told he could not redeem the balance. Yeah, look at your gift cards and, and know that you can ask for your cash back smart consumer now again if you cash it you can cash in a card if the balance is under ten dollars california is one of only 11 states that let you redeem a card with a low balance but california's ten dollar threshold is the highest of all of the states now as for that leftover dollar fifty on spencer's card he says they ended up using it to buy more paint. <laughs> now, I want to hear from you. The 7 on your side hotline is open Monday through Friday from 10 to 2. That number is 415-954-8151. You can also reach me on my Facebook page and through abc7news.com. Do not let that money go to waste. No, absolutely not. That would be a waste. Yeah. Thanks, Michael, very sure. much.